Hey, in this next demonstration, I'm going to show you how to do the notched shelf block here. And you'll notice that it is still 6 inches long by 2 inches tall by 3 inches wide. So what I'm going to do first off is I'm going to create a block that is 6 inches by 3 inches, and I'm going to extrude it at a height of 2 inches. And then I'm going to do a secondary sketch on the front face of that block, and I'm going to basically draw this shape here, and I'm going to push that back at a distance of 2 inches. So I have gone to create a new document, and I have named it Notched Shelf. I hit OK. Now that I'm in my workspace, the very first thing I need to do is to start a new sketch in the top view, and then I'm going to look down on the top. I'm going to use the Rectangle tool to create a rectangle from the origin that measures 6 Enter, 3, enter, 6 by 3. Now I'm going to change my camera to the isometric view, and I'm going to choose my extrude tool, and I'm going to extrude that, not 1 inch, but 2 inches, enter, hit the green check mark. Now that I have this block, I want to make my second sketch on this face of the block. So I'm going to go to sketch, now, in order to choose the sketch plane, I'm going to go right here until it lights up, and I'm going to select this surface. Now I'm going to look at the front as if it were flat, like a piece of paper. And I'm going to use my line tool now. And I'm going to start my line tool in this bottom corner here. And I'm going to draw a line from this corner all the way up to this corner. Now from this corner, I'm going to continue with my line along this top edge. I'm going to make another line, and this one's going to be 2 inches long. Hit Enter. The next thing I need to do is make a line going straight down for 1 inch. And then I'm going to travel to the left in this direction for 2 inches. Enter. Now, I'm going to make a line until I hit this line at the bottom, and I can tell because my perpendicular uh, indicators show up on my screen here. Click here, and then meet myself back at my starting point right there. So now, if I change my camera angle to isometric, okay, and I go to my extrude tool, you'll notice that this section wants to pop out. Well, I don't want it to pop out, so I want to, instead of adding, I want to remove, and I don't want to remove one inch, but I want to remove two inches. Enter, and then hit the green check mark, and there is your notched shelf.